We're Megan and Anna, and in our last episode, we hopped on our first international flight in two years, where we flew to the tropical paradise of Fiji. We had the most amazing welcome at the Fiji airport, and Anna even danced with some of the locals. Now it's time to start exploring this tropical paradise. Bula and welcome to Fiji everybody. Last night we flew into Fiji, we had the most amazing view and we had the most amazing welcome at the airport. They were all singing and dancing and this just gave us such a cool vibe for what's to come on our Fiji trip. So this morning we woke up pretty early because we had to catch a taxi to Dinaral port. It was actually super super cool here. This is basically the main port of Nandi where they catch all of the boats. It's actually located on Dinaral Island which the guy in the taxi was telling us it's actually man-made for tourists, which is a little bit interesting. Doesn't look man-made, it's crazy. It's where all of like the posh hotels are and everything. So we're making our way over to a place called Beachcomber today. It's this beautiful island. Now it's gonna be about an hour and a half boat ride across, but first of all, we need to go and pick up some breakfast because I am so hungry. Now one thing that I'm noticing about Fiji straight away is you don't have to wear masks so all the restrictions have been dropped so you can just roam around freely obviously make sure you're using hand sanitizer and stuff but it feels so good to wear a mask especially because the humidity and the heat is so much here it would be extremely hard to wear a mask in these conditions. Good morning everyone, Bula from Fiji! So we've just arrived in Beach Coma. We've just checked in. The process was super, super easy. All they needed was our vaccination passes and our passports. Um, you do have to have your test 48 hours to 72 hours after you arrive in Fiji. So we booked it here with Beach Coma. Look at this view behind me here. You get a welcome drink as you come in. They bring all your luggage in here for you. And now we're going to check out our room. 
Guys, we just got here. That's probably one of the best places we've ever been because I can see the sea from my door. So let's see the room. Kind of oh, a <laughs> little bit of trouble there. Too excited, I see. <laughs> there we go, there we go. Get ready. Ta -da! Hey! Oh my god, how cool. Good air con, which is oh, positive. It's nice and cool in here. Guys, I found the hammock. <laughs> this is so exciting. For me, like a hammock is like the pinnacle of paradise. Oh, oh no, this is gonna be. Oh. <laughs> I'm not quite in. Do a little shimmy. Oh, I'm kind of like on the side. <laughs> I can't get up properly. Oh, I was too excited to hop in. Look at my legs. <laughs> oh my god that's the funnest thing oh. megan has tried to get into that position for the last 20 minutes okay. you got that babes yeah now that we are like here and just settled it just feels so nice i have to say like i have already never been anywhere like this before you just look around and you just take a moment and just be so grateful for the life that like I live especially. It's just, the water is so blue. I've never seen water this blue before. And you know, things will always go wrong. Like the boat, for example, one engine working, but you know, you make the most of it. Like you're on holiday, we're not in a rush. Yes, stuff happens, but like, look where I am right now. This place is absolutely insane. So we're spending the next three days here on Beachcomber. Now we've booked like a seaside bungalow, which is super cool. It was around, I think, $990. But you get breakfast, lunch, and dinner all included in that package. So you don't have to worry about food at all, and you can get all of your drinks and everything, which I'll be having a lot, charged to your room. I'm just so excited to get into the water and just like live up this island life, eh? This is just oh, amazing. Alrighty, so we've all changed into our bikini and beach wear. Gonna make our way to like the main beach front now. We are like right on it, but we're kind of on like the back end and um, the more like private and quiet end. So I'm very excited to go swimming. Cannot wait. I dip my toe in and it's like lukewarm bath water. I'm so excited. What way do we go? This way, yeah, I think. You're going to the wrong way. <laughs> with that that's a part guys I just want to go for a swim but we saw on the agenda today after lunch we're gonna see turtles and then there is a boat to see some corals around as well just it's just gonna be amazing guys welcome to this paradise <laughs> It's so so clear and it feels like lukewarm like bath water. Look at that. <laughs> oh, this is literal paradise. Oh, just so I just all I have to say is W O W. Wow, the word that I keep using is just wow. It's insane. Pinch me because this is like where I am right now. <laughs> Anna bought me the goods. Can't go to Fiji and not having a go Fiji. Cheers. Cheers. So as I kind of mentioned before, breakfast, lunch and dinner is all included. After that beautiful swim, we had a little bit of a hiccup with the GoPro. It didn't quite work, but we will get it working. So we're going to go for some lunch before our turtle viewing, which we're very excited about. Look 
a there, a walk of someone that has nothing to worry about it, but to be on a paradise for days. You in a hurry for anything, Vida? No, nothing at all. It's a paradise, baby. <laughs> Welcome to Fiji. Ooh. So we just went to see the turtles. Now I have to say, um, it wasn't what I was expecting. I was expecting for us to come like go out into the boat and see them in the wild, but they actually have like a couple of turtles actually here on site at Beachcomber. Look, I am someone that loves animals and the sea and everything. And um, they're kind of kept in this little tiny pond and it wasn't really like, it didn't make me feel good. So I didn't stay for very long. I just kind of left. I think you're in such a beautiful um, place. I don't want to be seeing like turtles in a, a small little pond like, just so yeah um i it wasn't very successful but that's totally cool we're gonna try and do some snorkeling and stuff so they have free activities every single day which is super cool there's like a program on the board and it tells you at like what times you can do everything just watched the best sunset ever guys this is really a paradise but we had something to eat dance floor is open and we are having a lima competition do you reckon i'll win megan says i will yeah go team anna this is already ready for the lima dance competition tonight i want everybody to say bula bula all right yeah, go. left again left again oh. 